Hi everybody, this is Glenn Kennedy from project.insearch.com. I have a super special guest today. His name is Ryan Connolly. I've known him for years. We, went, we go way back. We've done all kinds of businesses together, learned from him. And I tell you what, he's really got a home run that he's going to talk to you guys about right now. And Ryan, you have just been tearing it up out there on FutureNet. Um, I've, I've, you've been kind of keeping me informed and then all of a sudden your income just jumped tremendously in the last month. Tell people a little bit about why everybody needs to be getting on, on this future net right now. Yeah, Glenn, I appreciate you having me on this on this uh, today. And um, since I've met you, we, you and I have studied the concept of uh, incentivized social media. And um, it has been, um, you know, we've seen other companies try to do this before and, and really studied what it was going to take to have something that would be, be have, have the capability of beating out Facebook. And uh, what, what the big trend is right now is the concept of uncensored, the world's first uncensored and encrypted uh, social media platform that pays the free members in Bitcoin. And that's how I describe what FutureNet is all about. And what we've witnessed is that um, because of how this thing is set up in the integrity of the company, uh, we have seen FutureNet um, grow tremendously recently. Uh, we are now 1.1 million users in this social media platform, and it's been, uh, I've been with them for 14 months now. Uh, my business partner, Alka, and I have, uh, we are number one in the entire company, so that's been a blessing. But what we've noticed is that in countries such as China, for example, where censorship of uh, Facebook has been there, and also YouTube and Google, um, here we have another option for them to get involved in the social media network. And uh, when that happened, uh, that's when we saw this just, you know, our income substantially increase. Yeah, absolutely. And, and you know, I've got on the side here, while people are going to be watching this video, I've got FutureNet up to the right of where you're at right now. And I just wanted to show people an example, because how many friends do you have, like 10,000 something? You know, I'm, I'm actually over, tw I think it's about 12,500 12, friends. And, and what's interesting about this, Glenn, is, you know, Facebook, they only want you to have 5,000 friends. <laughs> And, you know, it's not that it's a popularity contest out there, but what it really comes down to is Facebook is choking. They're, they're slowing down the flow of information. So right. when something's trending, for example, they can, you know, throttle down the trends. Right. You know, they can manipulate. What's that? Yeah, absolutely. Right? They're throttling. The right. They're, they can manipulate hashtags. Kim Kardashian could take out Google, for example. I always say slime a few million dollars for lunch, and they could be a trending hashtag and something, something more important, you know? <laughs> so, uh yeah, so, you're exactly yeah. right, and, and that's the thing is they limit you to 5,000 friends, but one thing that I've noticed is it's even worse than that is like you said, when I first joined Facebook in 2010, I had 1,000 friends, you know, after about a year or whatever. I could get two, 300 shares. Now I'm lucky if I can get 15 or 20 shares, and I've got on my screen right now my free energy post that I posted just a couple of 18 hours ago, and it's already had 124 likes. It's that's like probably ten times more than my Facebook. Yeah, th th I mean, there you go. I mean, I see that also. Just the interactions taking place, like I'll have fifty-two mm -hmm. likes, for example, compared to a Facebook post of like twenty-five likes or something. So, <laughs> you know, um, especially I know Glenn that you're really big into the political stuff with all your blogging and stuff out there. And uh, you know what, what we've seen in, uh, without getting too political in this conversation, but uh, they're definitely taking the people out there that are raising awareness about certain. Um, issues um you know there's a lot of uh manipulation when it comes to uh this uh people uh you know censorship on facebook and so you're experiencing that and so now being a place compared to facebook where i have five thousand friends i have twelve thousand five hundred my reach is much more greater on a network that only has 1.1 million um people compared to facebook of having uh, bill, you know billions that they have right now you know right because it's all manipulated and they're a bunch of scum that all they want to do is control us you know so i'm going to pull up we'll just so that. yeah so we can i'm going to pull up right now my the go back to the home button where basically it takes you where you can get into your business because how many ways um can you make money in future now and i know there's like three or four ways that i'm aware of you know it, it, and i'm still honestly i've uh, I still don't know all the ways of getting paid, but a few things we can get into. First of all, there is the, this is the three by ten force matrix, and that's beautiful, Glenn. As we were talking about before, it means that not it's not necessary that you necessarily bring someone into the business. The overflow as the company becomes more popular over time can go into your matrix, then take off like that. So that's a beautiful thing. I've seen some people have some wonderful results. I'm not making income claims or anything like that, but. Uh, 
I've seen see people um, that really aren't into recruiting, their experience is spillover. Um, so it, look, so you can take the, the compensation plan is composed of six different matrix matrices matrices right? right okay and so this starts at ten dollars the next one's twenty five dollar but one time buy in a fifty dollar one time buy in a hundred dollar one time buy in a five hundred dollar one time buy in a thousand dollar one time buy in biggest package is sixteen eighty five for all uh, six of those matrices right there and so. And so what you can do is you can take any of those matrices and divide it by $20, 20 people, because that's the break even point for these matrices, which is nothing considering that it's 88,000 people that fall into each of these six matrices. So anything after 20, you're in the green all the way up to 80, you know, the 88,000 people right there. Okay. And, uh, uh, so that's, that's phenomenal. So for example, the $10 matrix, you divide that by 20 people right there. And you're looking at 50 cents per person in that matrix that pays out $44,000 right there, 88,000 people times 50 cents, okay? Um, so and then you get the next matrix of, you know, an additional $25. You divide that by 20 people. You've got a, a payout of $1.25 per person right there, for example, yeah, right? And I'm, and I'm showing okay. I'm showing the graphics that you kind of showed me where you can make, you know, it tells you on each matrix, like on the $10, $10 matrix, you can make, what, $44,000? Is that correct? Yeah, so 88,000 people uh, times 50 cents per person is 44,000 total. Wow. And, and just so people can get excited, Brian, and like I said, this will blow most people's mind. Tell people what you're making like now because it will just blow their minds. <laughs> you know, I'm trying to get away from talking income so much. Um, honestly, um, we're, we're kind of changing our marketing plan to really focus on the lifestyle that we're doing and traveling the world so much. So. You know, I'll be in Nigeria here. Al and I will be in Arizona this week, and we have a professional paintball. We even uh, next week, um, we've had the top paintball players in the in the, in the world sign up with FutureNet. We're going to bring this into the UFC, going to extreme sports is one route we're going. Uh, and I'll get into this a little bit more, Glenn. But I want to share with you guys what's taking place across the globe. We'll be I'll be in Nigeria the following week. Then we come home and we'll go to uh, Manhattan and then Vietnam. Also, Al could be in Vietnam, so we're booking uh, Vietnam tickets today. So. But the income is, is, is growing substantially. I think we, we have a case study basically right now at this point that uh, I always say this, if not this, then what? And, and what I mean in this case, for example, is how do we change the most people amounts of lives and how do we make the most amount of money? I truly believe that incentivized social media, which I've studied just as long as Bitcoin, uh, it, you know, in those two coming together right now, this is a perfect, you guys can see I have an Ethereum tattoo right here and a FutureNet one that's actually good. <laughs> Healing right here for the Futura coin that we're launching, which we can talk about also in a few minutes. Yeah. Uh, but uh, that's, you know, the things are taking place in the company right now. You, you can you can see a steady income and serve a lot of these network marketing companies with a lot of, you Up know, flex, flexibility in your, your, your monthly paychecks. This pays out every 15 minutes. It pays out in Bitcoin mm -hmm. and also uh, pays out in physical gold if you want it that way as well. So uh, we're just feel we, we know that we're in a very good place right now and that uh, we're just getting started with 1.1 million users. I mean, imagine what's going to happen when we have a billion users on this platform. So, yeah, and then this is like getting into Facebook if Facebook wasn't evil and they actually paid you, you know, because <laughs> that's the right, whole right. thing is yeah. they, they, don't, they don't let you make a penny on Facebook. And, and there's another thing where we'll just touch on real briefly, but the Future Ad Pro, I really like that advertising. I do really well on it. That's just another way you can make money. And, and don't you even make – you make some money even on posting and things like that as far as that well, goes. You know, the, the one thing we have to touch base on also is let's talk about the check match bonus also because we already talked about the matrices, what if you're getting paid in these matrices. For example, in the $1,000 matrix, matrix, you matrix, you divide that by 20. You've got $50 per person coming in at that level at the $1,000 matrix. But it's a complete payout of 74 million dollars as the one-time buy-in right there okay wow. so that's that you know for 1685 buying all these matrices it's worth it but let's talk about the check match yeah. aspect of this because this is humongous okay. Glenn. okay um so for example when you're in the hundred dollar matrix the five hundred dollar matrix and the, or the thousand dollar matrix it's a 50 percent check match on every single person that you directly bring into that are in at those levels right there okay on the uh, let's go ahead and go reverse though you, from the, the, the fifty dollar matrix, for example, that's a, a, a that's a forty percent check match. The, the twenty five dollar matrix, 
is a 30% check match. In the $10 level, it's a 20% check match on all your people. So what this, what this really brings into the compensation plan is this compensation plan shifts gears in so many beautiful ways where when I, people come in Fusion, I say, hey, look, either I'm looking for people to join at the $185 level or the $85 level because this is the shift between the 50 and the 40% check match right here. And then I say, we've got some smaller packages and we've got some bigger packages as well. Shout out to Bitcoin.com, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> Got a Rolex with Bitcoin this week. <laughs> yeah, you've done. I mean, I know you don't like to talk about money, but I mean, I just saw the other day where you, you were laughing because you'd made like fifteen thousand dollars before lunchtime. So I mean, this is huge money. <laughs> you know, if you, I, I always say this. I have an issue that Mark Zuckerberg took forty-two billion dollars and put that into offshore accounts. <laughs> we are the we are the content creators. I can understand you make big technology, but when a digital technology exists now, if not this, then what? How can we make this technology benefit mankind? And this, really, we've been robbed. So, you know, Facebook is making $25 billion a year. Facebook never paid you a lucky penny. Huh. It's time to pop that bubble right there. It's time to take that money back. So I really think that this is something Donald Trump is going to embrace since he embraced ACN back in the days. I think it's going to be a domino effect, I'm predicting, among, you know, all the truth warriors that you're uh, working with uh, Glenn right, because there's the, all the one we, marketers. We were just talking about that, and I, I don't know. I think that that other thing was called Gam or something like that, but uh, it was on an Alex Jones show, whatever it was called. But you had said you already looked at it, and it's nothing compared to what we've got a future now. I mean, this is right. they've got they've got the technology that Facebook's got. I mean, it's fast now. I mean, when it first started, it was a little bit slower, but now I can't see any difference between capabilities yeah. on Facebook. And the thing that they can't replicate is the culture. When you have a compensation plan this that, that is really filling in as strong as this thing is filling in, you're developing a culture. When I went to the Poland event uh, with Alka, you know, I saw the culture. I sensed it. Because I remember thinking as I followed Facebook and watching it evolve from the MySpace, right? Like, well, when are we going to have a party locally that involves all the people? Well, it comes down to financial connections and stuff. And so I want to talk. Can I talk about the Futuro coin a little yes, bit? Yes, please do. This is, this is the most exciting thing because this is going to be happening in the fall, right, after the summer's over? Yes. So, the, yes, this is going to be a real coin. And I want to stress the importance right now of coming at the 1685 level because that's the royal position. And the royal position is going to be paying out these coins. And um, so the royal position is the 1685 level, uh, level there. And it says, I'll just read these bullet points real quick. Uh, becoming a royal member, you get your FutureNet coins. I hear that you get 50 FutureNet coins is what I hear right now. The Futuro coin, they call this. Yeah. Okay. You, one, you get extra coins if you're in the royal position. Two, you get extra coins for each day you're a royal member. So that's if you join now between now and when we, when we launch this coin in September, October. Three, you get extra coins for each frontline royal member in okay, your direct uh, uh, sponsorships. And four, you get extra coins for each royal member in your team. So keep in mind, your team is 10 levels deep, 3 by 10, 3, 9, 27, down 10 levels deep, holding 88,000 people right there, okay? I always say, think outside the box and think within the pyramid, because that's the strength of this thing right here, okay? Yeah, absolutely. I've got it up on my screen showing the tree structure. Okay. You guys, now why I believe this coin is going to be huge, I'm going to give an example of why Futuro coin, I really truly believe that we're going to be in the top five cryptocurrencies this year, okay? I'm gonna give you a reference. If you look at a, a, a website called steemit.com, S-T-E-E-M-I-T.com, what it was is, it was a blogging platform, a Reddit blogging platform that somehow they created a cryptocurrency out of this called Steam, coin, Steam okay, S-T-E-E-M. So if you go to coinmarketcap.com, you'll see it hovering around number 25 out of the top 1,000 cryptocurrencies. Right. Steam was an example of how monetization of content turned into a cryptocurrency based off of popularity, okay? Now, the thing that was really missing is, okay, if you look at what, how coins have gone here, you got, first of all, you got the things that have happened in cryptocurrency, you have encryption, and you got decentralization. That's all about cryptocurrency. But then Ethereum came along and did smart contract technology, okay? So now you got three things. What Futuro coin is bringing to the table here is monetization on a smart media, it's kind of a smart contract cryptocurrency just like Ethereum, but it's going to tie into monetization of content like Steam did in monetization of relationships, okay? So when you take that into consideration, these, I think when you're looking at what's taking place in the Ethereum, excuse me, the Bitcoin community right now and 
Roger Ver and these people fighting back and forth. Uh, uh, excuse me, excuse me. Oh, there, I'm back. You're back. Oh. Okay. Okay. Hold, hold on, guys. We have a bad. Can you hear me? Oh, we lost sound. Hold on. Hold on, guys. We'll try to get him back and we'll cut this out. Hold on. I don't know what's going on. That was weird. Ryan, Ryan, Ryan. Yeah, you have your. Yeah, one second here. One second here. I'm sorry. Oh, we'll okay. cu we'll cut it out. Hopefully, are you okay? Yeah, we'll cut we'll cut the uh, glitch out. We lost we lost your sound, and that's why I had to hang out. Yeah, sorry about that. Someone, someone tried calling me. Sorry about that. Okay. All right. So, um, all right, we're gonna pick it up. Okay, Ryan, we just got you back. Um, you yep. were talking about Steam it mm -hmm. and why you think the Futura coin is gonna be so huge because it's gonna have a lot of users, I guess. Yeah, yeah, right. We got lots of users. If, yeah, we're predicting that we're at 1.1 million users right now. By September, October, when we launch this coin in Dubai, we have 2 million users as the game plan here. And I, and I truly think that is possible because <clears throat> when we came out with the video for the Futuro coin recently, it really kind of gave us that injection of legit hype that, you know, something we, and I mean that in a positive way, something that we can run with right now between now and September, October, when we launch this cryptocurrency. Right. We've seen... We've seen these other coins launched and stuff like that. We've seen huge numbers, companies like OneCoin, you know, whether people believe these coins to be real or not real and stuff like that. But I, I do know the integrity of Stephen Morgenstern and Roman Zemian, of the two CEOs of FutureNet, and they will not fall short of having a legit cryptocurrency. Right. And I was actually just interviewed uh, with by Tone Bays of the, the World Crypto Network recently. You can find that video on YouTube if you type in Ryan Conley and World Crypto Network. Where we discuss the um, the Futuro coin, and I want to you know, say thank you for Tone Base for that interview. And Stephen Morganson was actually on that call as well. So, I think the cryptocurrency community is really going to uh, love what they see here when this uh, you know comes about. Absolutely. So, Ryan, everybody, the time to get in this is is right now because we've got a we've got some time before the cryptocurrency comes out. And and can you just because I'll be talking to people, I'll get them, I'll be getting them signed up and everything. But can you tell people some of your marketing strategies that are working the best for bringing new people that have never been in the Future Net Network? You know, what kind of uh, maybe marketing or tips that can you give everybody on how what's a good way to bring people in? Well, I always say this: persistence, consistence, leverage, and dynamics. Anything is possible. So a lot of people say persistence and consistence. Um, and I just added leverage and dynamics on that. And what I'm going for is I'm going for the domino effect is what I'm going for in this. I want to get this in Donald Trump's hands. I've had half an hour long phone calls with people like Kim.com and, and uh, John McAfee and uh, some of the biggest names in the industry that are, you know. So with this technology, we're, again, we're going for the domino effect. And we work as a team here to go, you know, uh, to just stir the pot and let people know how big this is. Like Ron Paul should know about FutureNet, I truly believe, right? right. You know, um, so Alex Jones should know about FutureNet, um, and uh, Donald Trump should know about FutureNet. So I have a simple belief that uh, uh, that uh, social media, incentivized social media at the, the least, should feed every single person on the face of the earth. And I think that's an easy thing to accomplish right there. Uh, and I think we can do that uh, in a year, to be honest with you. You know, uh, when we see... When we, um, oh. um, Okay. okay, sorry. So, so anyways, um, so what I'm doing is I encourage everyone, you know, uh, first of all, change your banner on your Facebook to be uh, something, you know, a FutureNet uh, banner because that's your biggest billboard, right? right. We are, we, we are, our goal is to get 100% off of Facebook and free yourself from the, the from the uh, uh, you know, Facebook. So you know, post a whole bunch. You know, join the WhatsApp group. Make sure that you're in the future, the FutureNet uh, global group. You got about 7,500 people in that group right there. Um, you know, you make sure you, you think specifically who those three people you originally are going to bring in because those people are going to get one third of your spillover right there. Right. Make sure that you 
this is the simplest way to get this done. We were talking to one of our downlines today. He's like, how do you have success? All you do is you tell your friends, hey, have you heard about the new Facebook that pays the, the people in Bitcoin every single day? You know, that $25 billion that Facebook is getting to return this money back to the people, right. you know? Right. And I show people how much I'm making in a day and they, you know, I got the proof is in the pudding right there, right? So you'll all, you all be able to experience that. Once I have that, then they say, man, tell me some more about that. I say, hey, look, I'm going to shoot you an email and just watch the first 10 minute video. Then call me back and let's just talk about it for a minute here. This is humongous. Like it's going viral right now. Okay. And so they watch that video, they get back, and that's the time you want to put the person on the phone with your sponsor. You guys were only looking for you to get three people in, even though I brought like 400 plus personally <laughs> into this. Okay. Um, I see everyone as a prospect. Every single person needs this. Look what people pay for cable television, right? 80 plus bucks a month. This is a one time buy in. Everyone's got 10 bucks, even in, you know, third world countries. <clears throat> you know, so um, also, um, you know, we, I, 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 we have a moral obligation for this uh, to get this out to the world. You know, this is a, a servant driven project, um, not just chasing the money. The money will naturally come. It's just all a numbers game. So, all right. We're building something that's real, that's not censored, that's going to help people. And, and everybody's getting fed up with Facebook anyway. It's time to really hit them in the pocketbooks, bring over our networks, and make money at the same time. I mean, that's the best of both worlds, I think, right there. Yeah, it, it, it just on the, in the future of Bitcoin, when we launched this thing, having 2 million people that are already aware of Bitcoin, that are on the world's, you know, this social media network, that are all getting paid in cryptocurrency, uh, that um, are just more um, knowledgeable about cryptocurrency than the, the typical person on Facebook watching Kardashians, you know, so. <laughs> That's what I've noticed. I was going to ask you, why is the typical person on FutureNet is like worth 10 times more than a Facebook user, a Facebook user, all they care about is their cat videos, and it seems like, and it's probably because of your marketing and others, but it seems like all the future net people are, like, they're all into making money, they know, most of them know about Bitcoin, why is that? Well, uh, they just don't know better, they've uh, been brainwashed for so long, and uh, it's amazing, you can show someone that you make 10000 or $20,000 in a day, Glenn, and you'll see their eyes just kind of like twitch and stuff like that, it's like, <laughs> You know, like a robot almost having a, 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 a short circuit, right? Yeah. So even though it makes complete sense, and here they are doing their nine to five uh, wage slave jobs, as we call them sometimes, uh, you know, it just, there's a better way. I see instead of my social media as being something that's going to change global distribution of goods, and we're going to do that. Uh, I just want to touch base on that so you can see the long term play vision here is, for example, if we had Solar City or Tesla Motor Cars, and they bring their they strike a deal with FutureNet and they just issue a compensation through the matrix. And even if you never bought a Tesla Motors car, you're getting paid or organic food, global distribution around the earth. You know, right. uh, This is how it should be done, I truly believe. And I think it's the reason why so many people have believed in network marketing and you know, product based companies for so long. So um, we're going to completely change things. But um, um, let me see, Glenn. Why, why, uh, why, do you, why do you think, though, that the FutureNet – person is so much more in tune with bitcoin and making money is it just because of people well, like you that are bringing the the good people over see the, the cool thing if you look at the difference between how facebook came about and how FutureNet came about and the evolution of what's happened online is i always say that people are online looking for a way to get off of line yeah. okay so we can be more in tune that we can be around people that are more in tune and more not on their cell phones all day long i mean look how much Look how much the family life is just falling apart. Like right. it's it's just a mess. It's like uh, smoke and mirrors, basically a, a reality, right? It's just uh, people are on their virtual zones, and where well, the other person's in their physical reality, right? right. So, um, so th this is going to um, uh, just uh, the, the people on, on FutureNet. You know, they've got the memo. They're they're more in tune with what's going on. They're more tech driven. Uh, they know about Bitcoin. But you know, you have to. Here's the difference in how the two came about is. Facebook was just among college people just having a good time and stuff. Right. You, that was in its infancy stages. It's composed, these are online marketers. So it's like if you build a city, you know how they have all the – in China, they build these cities. And there's nothing even there. They're just ghost towns. You right, know? Right. Okay? The best way to build a city is you have commerce taking place first where the people then come on board, not just a party, kick it place and stuff like that. That doesn't make the strong foundation right. of a, of a long-term – this is what is going to actually be – uh, the next Facebook and replace it because of these reasons. The city is being built with uh, income producing uh, activities here, revenue, RPA we call it, revenue producing activities, instead of 
food porn and all the cats and stuff, you know, <laughs> NRPA, non-revenue producing activities. So that's the difference what's going to take place, and that's going to be the big wake-up call this year. And people are going to understand that they're smart enough to uh, make this jump. It's going to be uh, – we are going to be a household name this year. Well, absolutely, and, and, and I do go out to the Truth community a lot, and I just saw that Adam Kokesh joined. I don't know. Did you, did you get him? <laughs> you know, I had him text me uh, yesterday and the day before, and uh, I'm excited um, about Adam uh, coming on board. Um, and yes, uh, Adam and I are friends. We met down in uh, you know, Anarchapulco, the Bitcoin uh, um, conference held by Jeff Berwick, the Anarchy Bitcoin conference in yeah. Acapulco. So that was a lot of fun, and that's where I met him. And, uh, you know, what I told Adam was this is, you know, Adam was arrested for shotguns right. on the lawns of the White House. Remember that? <laughs> right, right. So I called Adam shotgun, <laughs> right? He's got this shotgun approach, and the conversation that we had down at Anarchapulco was he understands that he was – there was actually – we had the same calling just to catch up speed on where people are. Like he understands that this has to be the way that the people come together. Um, we had a really great conversation last night, you know, just about how love has just gone kind of – uh, off uh, key with how Facebook has done things. Right, um, right. It, it has to come down to monetization. It's the wild west out there in social media. But Adam, Adam had a concept idea when we, him and I met uh, that uh, you know, with, to, in order for something like this to happen, you'd have a shotgun approach to getting the message out there across all your social media platforms that you are now part of future, uh, a different social media network. But he didn't have the social media platform in mind. There's more this approach, you know, to, that that could be applied to. You know the best, uh, uh, so, right? Social media network. Okay. Yeah. So, anyways, um, Adam and I will be talking again today, and uh, we'll see how things go. But uh, he knows what we're doing. He loves it, and what's meant to be will be. You know, everyone is exactly where they need to be right now, and uh, we're all coming together to yeah. uh, change this. That's what we right need now. to just unify, so they can't divide and conquer us anymore. That'll that'll short circuit the the new world order's plan. So, whether you're in the truth movement or you just want to make money, future nets it. Ryan just gave you the breakdown. And uh, is there any last words you want to say? I, I just want to say, you know, thank you, everyone, for taking the time to listen to this. And thank you for considering and come on board with us. Um, again, I think you'll really like what you have to see over here. Uh, make sure you download the mobile app that you sign up underneath Glenn, uh, Glenn's team over here. He's very supportive. And uh, we're going to be working very closely, guys. Um, I think that this is the best way for all of you to support the truth movement, that we own this form of communication, which is social media. It is the most clean and disruptive uh, uh, form of communication that creates accountability among others when it's done properly, and that's what how monetization of uh, uh, content production relationships is going to uh, digitally rewire human consciousness, as I call it. Awesome. I'm at. Yeah. I got a. I got a call. I got to hop on. As okay. No problem. Hey, hey, thanks for taking the time, and we will be talking to you real soon. Take care, Ryan. Hey, thank you all. Take care. Bye bye. All right. Bye bye. <laughs> All right, there you have it, guys. Ryan took time out of his busy, busy day, and he doesn't like to talk about money, but I can tell you this. He's making over 500 k a month, and I'm just really excited about this. And as you can see, guys, if any of you've got a prime opportunity to be at the top of my matrix still, because look at this. You go to my $10 matrix, I'm just now filling up my, what is that? That's my third row. But it gets even better, guys, because if you come in here all the way to the $100 level, as you can see, I've just got my first three. But if you come to the $500 level and you get in that level, you're going to be one of my top three. So the first three people that come in and get that $500 level are going to get one-third of my spillover. So I know that's going to push some people in here and get you going. This is a good deal, guys, and if you possibly can, definitely, if you can, I'm going to actually do this. You'll, I'll have this bought as soon as before this video even comes out because I didn't realize that you were actually going to get more Bitcoin for as many days as you are a royal member. So I'll be getting a royal member. So if you come in with a royal member, you're going to get those 50 uh, Futura coins as well as other opportunities for the mining and everything that's going to happen with that. So, but at least um, I would say you come in at this $500 level, which is basically you, when you come in at that level, you're, you're, you're going to be buying 10, 25, 50, and 100. So it's going to be 185 plus 500, 685. So for 685, if you're one of those first three, 
you'll get one third of my spillover. But even if you miss that, you're still going to be right near the top of my my uh, my structure there. And what I like about this, guys, is we've seen um, on our team that sometimes you have problems because some people get in and they don't do anything. Well, this the great thing about this is it doesn't matter because my efforts flow down. Like you see how this guy came under this guy, then this guy came under, and then the next one will come over here and it will go across and then it will fill in until this whole row is done. Okay? And it goes row by row down 10 levels. There's no gaps. There's no blockages that can occur with other systems. So I'm going to, obviously, I have my link to sign up at the bottom of this video that you've been seeing. I want you to go ahead and sign up. Then I want you to contact me on Skype so I can get you into our Skype room. And we'll also get you into the, the main Skype room as well. But our Skype room is, is set up for our team specifically. We'll get you involved in everything. Just go ahead and contact me on Skype and uh, tell, me, tell me that you want to join our FutureNet team. Thanks a lot, guys. We'll be talking to you real soon.